Alright guys, this is going to be kind of a video split between multiple animals, but here's the feeding tub, which will soon be swarming with crickets. Downy. Alright. Um, get a couple more. Spyro is a growing boy, and he needs multi-foods. Um, we will eventually be getting to all of the animals in this video. But we're going to start out with Spyro. Now Spyro, um, here's his meal. He's going to be excited to see that. But Spyro, as mean as he seemed, um, he's under here. He's gotten a little bit nicer. I just need to be more gentle with him. And so, um, God forbid if he flips back and bites me. Try not to get angry and scream, but he's been a rather good boy lately. Good boy or girl. Not quite sure which sex you are, but very good job. No. Spyro still is a bit camera shy whenever he eats. So we're just going to leave him be for now. And I'm going to move on to the other animals. Now, <clears throat> first up on our list, um, let me put the camera down for a moment, are the Madagascar Hissers. And I took a look on YouTube and Google around the place to try and find out what Madagascar Hissing uh, cockroaches babies might look like, but, uh, so there's no signs of that, but, um, get y'all some light, uh, I just changed their little cricket feed, uh, there's blue and green crap, and there's a potato chop there, one, two there, and one right there, and let me kind of get them in more light, but, the male is the one that's on top right now. Just kind of get real close on him. But yeah, that's the female. He's either eating or cleaning the female. No, 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 that's the male. The one on the bottom is the female. <coughs> uh, you know what? Let me see if I can get a close up on this one. Sorry, that's really. Saki. But, um, yeah, those are the hissers, and I found out that you can really piss him off by rubbing his head. And, uh, he hasn't done it yet, but I, I really want him to hiss for you guys. If I try and pick him up, I know he'll hiss. Come on, buddy. Damn it, hiss. You'll be famous. You'll have more than one woman. <laughs> um, but yeah, Spyro's just chowing down over there. Anyway. Come on. Hiss. Hiss darn you. Man. All right. That's enough for the um, Madagascar hissing beetles, cockroaches, whatever you want to call them. Um, Spyro's just having a fun time getting those crickets. <laughs> Poor thing. But, um, yep, that's it for the hissers. Um, not much new about Sylvia. <coughs> I haven't. Natalie, hang on, I'm making a video. Uh, tell them we'll call him back. Okay. Anyway, um, Sylvia, nothing much new about her. I haven't recorded any of her recent feedings. Hey, now. Yeah, I haven't recorded any of her recent feedings, but she's gotten significantly bigger. Uh... I'd, I'd say she's about two, maybe two, maybe two and a half feet by now. But, um, yeah, there's not really that much new about her. 
Except that she's doing good. Go down. Come on. I'm sorry I got you excited. I'll play with you more tomorrow when I've got time. And a lot of... <coughs> a lot of people are asking me where I've gotten these um, black hide boxes that I've got for Sylvia and Geico. And I just get them at normal reptile shows, like... Yeah, just any re if you can find a reptile show near you, just look for them around there. All right, um, I don't really know what r went wrong here, but the centipede died, and I I really don't know what went wrong here. I fed him like two or three crickets, and uh, no, I fed him like every every week, every like Saturday or Sunday. Uh, sometimes it would get delayed off to Tuesday. Cause I wasn't at the house, but um, it, it was never more than a week and a half with within feeding periods. But I feed them like two or three dubia roaches that were about that size, and he'd go in and devour them. And every so often, I'd feed him like five or six crickets. And the cage was um, the cage was very moist, and especially a sponge. So, yeah, everything was really moist, but I really don't know what happened, so I guess I'll just do a lot more research before I get another one. Because I, I, I want to uh, have a centipede that will grow big and manly. But, yeah, uh, may, maybe I'll just get another one, name it Coronia, Corona, and no one will know a thing. Um... I got to cleaning out Geico's tank, and um, the substrate currently is just uh, two layers of paper towels stacked on top of each other, and everyone's going to be saying, oh, where's the light, where's the UVB light? It's off for now. God dang it, it's off for freaking a minute so I can make the video. But anyway, got his calcium dish, there's some crickets crawling on the paper towel, there is some very small cricket poop. Water dish, black hide box, and the big lady herself, Geico. Uh, we're, we might have to cut short on time in the video. But let me see if I can take her out for you. Yep, there's Geico. Big healthy girl. Yeah. I'm going to stick her back into her cage so she can go on about daily life. Not quite sure what that daily life is. Be it from sun masking to torturing the young crickets. Geico will make her choice in life. Now, uh, nothing in the mice chamber. They have all been eaten by the destroyer over there. But, uh, here's Jib Jab, Jimmy, Jim Jam, Jimina. He's got multiple nicknames. Um, he's got his infrared light, but, uh, yeah. Uh, changed it out. He's still on sand, and got his log formation. And he he's just chilling, and we got him a uh, water dish. They'll spread more. David, <coughs> and he will actually get in there and just kind of lay in the water, which is pretty cute. I'll have to get some pictures of that. But uh, that is Jimmy the Bearded Dragon. We're up close and personal. Oh, too close. Yep. Jimmy, Jimina, Jab, Jimab. Jimmy the female bearded dragon with male name. And Spyro is still struggling to get his food. Ooh, so close, girl. Or boy. Well, yep. That's it. I love how I can see myself. Yes, I got a haircut. But, um, yeah. Subscribe. Go. Yeah, yeah go over there, over there. I'm not sure which one it is. Also, running out of time, uh, I'm going to be making a video playthrough of me playing Condemned with my friend. Pitch darkness, middle of the night. It's going to be freaky as hell. See you later.